Hello. What kind of houses will we build in the future? And uh, after we build them, how will we heat them? We all have a special relation to buildings. We live, work and study in buildings that have to provide a good indoor climate, regardless of the weather. At the same time, buildings are required to use a limited amount of energy to reduce the impact on global climate. The energy we use should also be environmentally friendly, renewable. To reach the climate goals, there are a lot of things we need to do and can do, especially since buildings account for about 40% of our total energy use. I work at the Division of Energy and Building Design with research and education on energy-efficient buildings. The research includes developing and evaluating concepts and technologies for energy-efficient buildings. Already in the 90s, I carried out analysis to find out if and how passive houses, thus buildings with a very low energy demand, could be implemented in a Swedish climate. This resulted in the first passive houses in Sweden and after measurements and positive evaluations, the development continued with new applications and demonstration projects. Now, according to the European Union, we should reach nearly zero energy buildings for all new buildings from the year 2020. But how are zero energy buildings defined and how should they be designed? This is part of our research. I'm part of our research team and I'm focusing on how architects and urban planners can implement solar energy in the design process. I've interviewed Scandinavian architects and have performed an analysis of the obstacles and opportunities of solar energy in the Scandinavian context. Now I'm focusing more on urban planners to support them with guidelines for solar energy planning. For example, we simulated the active solar energy potential of planned building blocks in Lund and Malmö. We need technologies that are easy to use and with buildings that are attractive. Our research involves collaboration with the building industry and municipalities. Our knowledge is also disseminated within our international master program in energy efficient and environmental building design. 